A gentleman who wears a different sort of uniform is in our U.S. Bank customer spotlight this morning. Tom Duggar is the Scout Executive CEO of the local Dan Beard Council. He's an Eagle Scout and has been a professional scouter for 40 years. Scouting is alive and well in our area and is about to embark on a capital campaign to keep growing. Tom Duggar joins Business Courier publisher Jamie Smith in the studio. Gentlemen. Tom, thanks for being here today. Thank you, Jamie. So I understand you guys are about to launch a capital campaign for a camp in northern Kentucky. Yes, Jamie. We have Camp Michaels in northern Kentucky on Hathaway Road and uh, going down toward Rabbit Hash. 700-acre piece of property that the, the Boy Scout Council has actually owned since 1944 and it's largely underdeveloped and we have some pretty exciting plans for it. That's great. Now, obviously scouting is over 100 years old now. Is it still... You know, I know a lot of changes have gone on, but it is still important for youth and families today? Oh, Jamie, I think so. Perhaps today more than ever before. One of the features of the Camp Michaels campaign will be the development of a leadership center where we will be teaching leadership. We're actually running four weeks of leadership camp there now. We're going to a fifth week next year. So I think uh, young people need to, to know how to lead, uh, to guide, to advise. Uh, also, scouting today focuses a lot on uh, uh, skills that will prepare you for life, uh, from uh, skilled trades uh, to uh, sustainability. So there's many reasons why young people. It also gives young people a, a very important community to be a part of. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I know organizations such as the Scouts does require a lot of capital, <laughs> does require a lot of fundraising, and I know you guys have a Festival of Fireworks coming up that's kind of about fundraising as well. Yes, uh, the Festival of Fireworks is a great event, Jamie. We've done it for 26 years. We do it on Mount Adams uh, in the Celestial parking lot, okay. and due to the generosity of the Rippey family for the last 26 years, we've held a, a grand party there always on the Sunday before Labor Day okay. when the fire works happen and <clears throat> what's neat about this is that we control the parking and we park off-site and bus our customers up uh, to the party and uh, and they they enjoy it and then when it's over they get on a bus and they leave and they're generally on the way home before uh, the, the, everyone's off the river before the traffic gets crazy yeah. out there uh -huh. yeah well let's go back to the camp the, the capital campaign a little bit yeah. what's your goal what, what are you trying to accomplish with this sure Jamie we're looking at raising 10 million dollars and we've got a good start on that we have a lead gift for 1.5 uh, and uh, we're, we're going to be building a sustainability center where we will be teaching sustainability methods and te uh, techniques, careers. Uh, we'll also have the leadership development and then an important uh, wilderness uh, fun adventure area that uh, uh, scouts would, can do zip lines and canopy tours. Uh, that sounds like a lot of fun and some fun into the education as well, right? It is, yes. Yeah, that's yeah. great. Well, listen, keep doing what you're doing. I know you guys are a very successful organization. You know, obviously it's successful in the entire country, but Cincinnati's done a great job with your organization. So keep us informed and let's talk a little bit more sometime soon about the leadership program. Thank you, Jamie. All right, thanks. Good day.